This segment is sponsored by Intermountain Healthcare and the Utah Department of Health. Well, September is National Suicide Prevention Month, and we have Al Romeo here, registered nurse at the Utah Department of Health, to talk a little bit about uh, antidepressants. Yes, and if, antidepressants. If, if women are pregnant and on an antidepressant, your hormones are going to go crazy on pregnancy, so what do you do? We want her to stay on those medications. Most of those medications have been very well studied in pregnancy and breastfeeding, so she can continue on them. Um, there are increased risks if she goes off of those medications. If she has untreated depression and anxiety in pregnancy, there's increased chance of miscarriage and low birth weight. If, it's, if it goes untreated. Correct. What if you haven't been diagnosed and then you start feeling depressed once you're pregnant? Can you go start antidepressants? Yes. Check in. Okay with your provider. Some of those antidepressants, for example, the SSRIs, uh, selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, okay. those can be used anytime. Um, we don't see an increased risk of birth defects above that baseline 3%, 5% that everybody starts with. One of the things to remember about those is once you start those, you should continue on those. If you stop abruptly, you can have some side effects. Mom okay. could have some side effects like dizziness, vomiting, mm -hmm. um, nightmares, tremors, those types of problems. So basically, the best thing is to talk to your doctor. Yes, check in with your doctor if you're unsure about those. Doctor may need to increase your dose later in pregnancy as your metabolism changes okay. and your blood volume changes. And is that your OBGYN or your it depends on you're seeing for depression. It depends on who's prescribing that. Okay. Sometimes the OBGYN will prescribe it and sometimes the psychiatrist will prescribe it. Okay. So get them together in the same room. Absolutely, <laughs> yes. Get on the same page so yes. you're healthy and, and and it helps the healthier baby. Yes, and she can use it during breastfeeding. We need mom at her best. So right. she's talking and playing with baby so baby can develop appropriately. Okay, and, and that'll factor into postpartum depression as well? Correct. Where you have to stay communicating. Absolutely. Okay. She may need to start those. If she doesn't have ongoing depression, right. she may need to start them after she delivers baby. Okay. Thanks so much, Nurse Al. Thank you. And if you ever have any questions about stuff like that, you can go to our website, KUTV.com, and click on Baby or Baby, and we have a connection right to these guys, and they have all the answers for you. Ron.